In this video, I'm going to show you awesome animated text stroke. Let's get started. To get started with our animated SVG text, jump into Adobe Illustrator to create your text. So I'm going to use the text tool over here and click once on the artboard and I'm going to write in the text that I want to show up inside of Elementor. This text will be animated. Now to use the animated SVG by Unlimited Elements, you're going to need a stroke element. So first of all, we need to right click on our text over here and choose create outlines. This will make the text an outline instead of text. Now these are shapes. I'm going to switch between the stroke color and the fill color in a way that the fill will be empty and the stroke will have a stroke. You can play around with the stroke if you want it to be thicker or something like that. I'm not going to touch this. I think this looks awesome. So the next thing is to jump into properties. And what we want to do is to get rid of all the white area around our text and leave only the text. So I'm clicking on properties. Then I jump into edit artboards. And over here inside of preset, what I'm going to use is fit to artwork bounds. You see now all the white space is eliminated and what we're left is only the text. The next part to export this as an SVG, I'm going to click save as and over here in format, I'm going to choose SVG. It doesn't matter the name because we're not going to fulfill this save, but I'm just going to click save once and over here before you click OK, go to SVG code. This is going to give you the code that you can paste inside of unlimited elements widget SVG animation. So I'm going to copy it. So command or control A to select all command or control C to copy. And then I'm going to jump in the web browser inside of Elementor. You're going to need, of course, unlimited elements installed with the SVG animation widget enabled. I'm going to search for the widget SVG animation, drag it inside. And first of all, as you can see, this is what it does. It just draws SVGs. Now I'm going to replace the current code with my code. So command or control A to select all, delete whatever is inside and paste your new code. Now check out how awesome this is. It's just going to animate your code. Now in the settings, you can change a couple of things. The most important things is the delay. This means how long it will take this to occur once it's scrolled to. So it's kind of hesitating to scroll, hesitating to animate until you scroll to it. And the second one is the duration. So if I want this to be a lot slower, I'm going to change it to three seconds, for example. And now you can see it's drawing really, really, really slow and awesome. I hope you like this tutorial and I'll see you in the next video.